Hi, this is Mark Kerr. I'm a regional director for the Alpha Group and uh, we help business owners to at least double the value of their business over two to three years and to dominate their market niche. So today I want to talk to you about customer retention. So here's a question for you. What do you think the most common reason is that a customer stops using an existing supplier and switches to a new supplier? Okay, well, <clears throat> research was carried out which showed that um, there are several reasons why people will uh, leave an existing supplier or a customer will leave. For example, um, they have been uh, snaffled by one of their opponents, they've offered them a better deal. And that is typically about 10% uh, of all customer loss. Um, also, um, the customer ceases buying that particular item or that particular service. Um, or they, um, the company itself has gone bust, the, the, the customer has gone bankrupt. Between those, that accounts for a further 10% of customer loss. Um, and then there are uh, other things such as um, a, a, a very close connection has started up in business in that particular area and so on and so forth. Basically, about 60% of the customers who leave their supplier leave for one reason. The reason is they believe that the supplier no longer cares about them and or their business. Okay, so if you want to keep your clients, show that you care for them. So one of the reasons that's prompted this particular topic today is I'm dealing with a, 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 a service business um, and we are reduced now to them sending me sometimes rather, terse, rather tersely worded emails um, short, sharp, and to the point. They probably think they're being very businesslike, but actually, um, I feel that they are not providing the level of service they should be. They're letting me down. They're not delivering what they said they said they would. And actually, all I really need is a phone call from them, or even better, they came to see me personally. However, I understand that's not always possible, and in most cases, it's much more practicable for the supplier to. Come ring the customer and that's fine show that you care there's no substitute for asking the customer how they are how they feel how things are going for them and most people are quite reasonable and will will tell you that yeah I'm a little bit disappointed to be honest with you I really need to step up and do X Y and Z and give the supplier the chance to really atone for any shortcomings so if you want to keep the customer satisfied show that you care um, a little phrase I learned at B&I is people don't care what you know until they know that you care. So show that you care and actions in this case speak a lot louder than words. So this is Mark Kerr, um, a regional director with the Alpha Group and I'll be sharing with you a daily video on how to improve either your business or your uh, personal um, activity. So um, please look at our Facebook page which is the Alpha Group Manchester or on LinkedIn on um, Business Network in Manchester. Mark Kerr from the Alpha Group. I'll see you same time tomorrow. Bye.